Target is offering an awesome two-pack of EV Evolutions and V Hero tins, which used to be $40, now discounted to just $19.99, and they can be ordered online. I picked up all three sets for a total of $60, but will I get my money's worth? Hey everybody, Rhino here, and yeah, I went ahead and picked up all six tins for just $60. They come with four booster packs apiece, so that ends up being 24 packs, and they're going for less than $2.50 apiece. You can't find much better of a deal than that. Now, I'm curious to see what kind of packs are in here. Last check, I had uh, Scarlet and Violet and Paldea Evolved packs in here, although I have heard rumors that some of these tins might be the older ones as well, so I'm curious to see what I've actually got here, and let's get into the pack opening. But before we get opening up these tins, I need your help. We recently hit 1,000 amazing subscribers, and I am so excited to be on this journey with you. But we need to help people discover more of the videos on this channel. If you could help me out by sharing this video with some of your friends and sharing it online, helping to get more people to discover the Rare Rhino Gaming channel, I'm sure that will help the channel grow and continue to evolve over time. I would really appreciate your help, and hey, if you haven't subscribed, please do consider clicking that big subscribe button down below. It really does help. Now on to the pack opening. And here they are, all six Evolution tins. Now, I noticed they didn't have a Glaceon or a Leafeon tin. I, I double-checked, I triple-checked to make sure, but these are the six tins that they have available. The Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeon are the EV Evolutions tins, and the uh, Umbreon, Sylveon, and Espeon, those are part of the V Heroes tins collection. So I'm curious to see what we actually have in here. I'm going to get all of these out of their packages, and we'll open the tins one at a time. Here we go. So here's all of the EV Evolution tins in all their glory, including the Flareon. I've decided I'm going to open Flareon first, because Flareon is one of my favorite Pokemon. It actually is one of the first cards I received that was a Hollow. So here's the one from the Jungle set here that I've had since I was a little kid. So uh, that's why I'm going to go ahead and open Flareon first. Now the Flareon tin is part of the... Uh, the EV Evolutions tins from 2021, which uh, makes you think it should have older packs in it, but I actually think this is going to have Scarlet and Violet and Paldea evolved. I think this is going to be a reissue. Let's tear into it and find out. Moment of truth, let's open her up. Here's our Flareon V, as well as the code card, and sure enough, I do see Scarlet and Violet in there. I'm going to tuck Flareon back in here so that I can put her back in the tin and keep her as a nice decoration for now. But yeah, there they are, Scarlet and Violet and Paldea Evolved. Four packs here. This must be some kind of reissue, because those packs certainly weren't available all the way back in 2021. So, Flareon, I'll set you on top for now. And before I open up these packs, uh, we'll play a little game here today. I'm going to put $60 beneath my picture here, and we're going to see if I can get the $60 that I spent on these packs back from the cards in these packs, or if this was still a waste of time. Hang out to the end and see if I make my money back or not. Anyway, here comes Scarlet and Violet, pack number one. Now, these still had the white code cards when they first came out, so I think that is still an indication whether or not we're going to get a hit. Since it's a Scarlet and Violet pack, it's only one card to the front. It's a Grass Energy. Go Goat, Scatter Bug, Shuppet, Sprigatito. Lots of grasses here. Judge, Float Soul, Miriam, Mabostiff, Starly, and a Cyclozar. So, nothing too special out of that first pack. Let's go Scarlet and Violet pack number two. Now, there are some uh, illustrators in here. There's some special cards. Nothing too crazy in Scarlet and Violet. And I think all of these packs may end up being Scarlet and Violet and Paldea Evolve, but we'll see. Ooh, grass again. Oh, Watchroll, Zangoose, Crow Gunk, Dadene, Heracross, Crocodile, Flamingo, Smoliv, Cloth, and a Miraidon EX. Nice! So I do get a hit out of the first packs here. Nice! It's a nice little $1 Miraidon coming out of the packs here, so I'll set that one aside and check it off of my totals here. We'll move on into Paldea Evolved, which is also an awesome set. I've really grown to appreciate Paldea Evolved since it came out. Kind of miss it a little bit. Certainly better for me than Obsidian Flames has been. So... Leo... And a Spiritu. Spiritomb's got a neat ability here. 
basically blocks all of the V abilities, which is kind of cool. It's got to be basic V, though. I've made that mistake before. <laughs> Evolve V's does not work. It only blocks the basic V's. And no EX's. And then we've got the other Paldea Evolves. It's got uh, Meowscarada on the cover. What do we pull? What do we pull? What do we pull? Uh, code card is one of them. And, ooh, sidekick. Jiggly Tad, Drefferby, Great Ball, Heracross, Kilowattro, Zoomerville, Wingle, Faulkner, nope. and a Hydreigon. <sighs> Nothing doing from those. Now, my next favorite is actually going to be Umbreon, and Umbreon is part of the V Heroes tin, which came out in 2022. However, I think this is also a reissue, and we're going to see Scarlet and Violet and Paldea Evolved. Let's open her up. Here we go. We've got the Umbreon, and sure enough, there's a Scarlet and Violet there. Code card for you. And our fun little Umbreon. And sure enough, two Scarlet and Violet to Paldea Evolved. Again, not bad for $2 a pack, though. Going in at $2 a pack, if I can try to make that back, I mean, you almost make a, a quarter of that back just from the bulk. You can usually get you know, 50 cents from your bulk cards, depending on where you sell them. Ooh, lightning. For little foy coco drowsy, near monama, vibillion, dark bun, hundower, Marie Band. Indeedy. Gives you an automatic evolution. That's kind of cool. So I am starting to look at finishing my Scarlet and Violet collection. However, I have not been getting any of the special cards. I've not been getting any of the rare pulls or anything like that. There's only a handful of special cards in this first base set here for Scarlet and Violet. Let's see. Fire? Hot psychic. But maybe that can change. I have a feeling I'm going to be opening 10 more. I suppose they'd only. I feel like I'm going to be opening 8 more. Well, there we go. I just have to complain. And sure enough, they show up. Rev of Room, but there's my boss stiff. A nice illustration, my boss stiff. So I'm getting poles from the Scarlet and Violet. Well, nothing yet from Paldea Evolved, but maybe these two will help me. This my boss diff almost covers the cost of the pack. I think the technical uh, number is $1.87, and this is worth $1.80. So this, along with the other, should cover the cost of the pack. That helps me. I'll be able to lower my number a little bit more down below and make my way a little bit closer to trying to make my $60 back. It's always a fun little game. Let's see if we can pull something from Paldea Evolved. And they've got some really cool uh, illustrator cards here. Really powerful cards, too. Ooh, maybe something here. Maybe something. I thought I saw shine. Water, Pineco, Meryl, Mankey, Delibur, Pusha, Miss Magius, Bramblegast, Reverse Tyranitar, Reverse Palmy, Jump Pot. Okay, so I was wrong. <laughs> Can I get an illustrator from this one? I'm going to see. I can predict the energy. And maybe give myself some good mojo. There's a code card for y'all. And the energy card is. Lighting. That's my favorite. Boogie woogie woogie. The Land Coros. <gasps> the Lycanroc EX. Alright. There's a hit. It's a nice shiny one too. I love those sparkles on it. Very cool. Lycanroc EX. Nice 75 cent card here. Not great, but not awful. Happy to make some of the uh, money back. And Unfortunately, that's going to be it for the Umbreon tin. Up next, I'm thinking Vaporeon. Don't get any thoughts now. So here's our Vaporeon tin, and yes, it's part of the EV Evolutions tin. EV Evolutions. So we'll cut into it, open it up, and uh, we'll see what we get. All right, Vaporeon. Going to guess more Scarlet and Violet cards in here. Hey, how about that? They sure are. There's the Vaporeon, and there's your code card. Alright, here's our four boosters. We'll start off with Scarlet and Violet. Now, in the last two tins, I've gotten hits out of Scarlet and Violet, and I've gotten one hit out of Paldea Evolved. So, can I keep that trend going? Can I get another Illustrator card from Scarlet and Violet? Let's go fire. Oh, that's grass. I'm getting a lot of grass. On your Wiglet. <laughs> Funny. Toad School, Sandile, Cyclozar, Vitality, 
Toxtricity, rev of room. Oh my god, I got it. I can't believe I got the Miriam. This is the big one too. This is fantastic. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is the only like super good card from Scarlet and Violet. And I got it. Well, pulling a nice $30 card will certainly help towards that $60 goal of trying to make my money back. And man, I can't believe I got the Miriam. This is a great hit. This is really nice. Thank you, Vaporeon. We've still got another Scarlet and Violet pack to open. Let's see what we get out of this one. By the way, that last one, white code card. So this is the point where the code cards no longer matter. The borders didn't matter anymore. So let's see, fire. Oh, darkness. Oh, Doom, Fido, Penny, Metacham, Waxwell, a switch, and a Starly, and a Coridon. This is great. This is a fantastic t Vaporeon, you're just throwing the hits at me today. Look at this stuff. So about three and a quarter from these cards together. Combine that with the Miriam, and I'm having a good time right now. I'm having a real good time. Can I get another massive hit, this time from Paldea Evolved? Let's find out who this opens up really easy. That's all suspicious. But, you know, I wouldn't say it's a... Uh, I wouldn't say that this is a scam pack because I got a Miriam. Let's go fire. Oh, fighting. I like to pick fire a lot. I don't usually get it right. Thank you, Delibird, Faulkner, Dundun, Spars, Simeon, Nimble, Bramblin. Jump on. No complaints. I had a great opening just a few minutes ago. No complaining. Vaporeon's brought me some good, some good, good stuff. Let's see what we get out of pack number four. <laughs> good card. Bring it to the front. Fight. Uh. Leo Rapska. Rabska, no longer pushing around a clod of dirt, is now upgraded to something a bit stronger. Espeon, again, part of the V Heroes tin collection from 2022. Let's crack her open. And inside this tin, we've got a promo. We've got a code card. Now, if I remember right, all of these promotional Evolution cards are the same ones that are offered in the Evolution uh, collection. I think you can buy that at GameStop. It's like a special collection. I have one of those, um, but all these Evolution cards are the same ones. I'm surprised they don't have a Glaceon and a Leafeon then if they're just using those promo cards. But maybe it's just the, the tin. They only like to release three versions of the tins. So Scarlet and Violet, you have just been on a roll today. Can I get another awesome card? of you another uh, illustrator something like that remember the code card colors don't count these are always going to be white code card borders for scarlet and violet move the energy to the front it is a metal Ooh, i got it i got one dolive annihilate nope. nothing much there i do need a bit more hits i'm now uh, i've got two tins left after the espion's done you do need a bit more to make my $60 back. That Miriam certainly helps, but what else is there out there? Let's see if we can start to pull some other goodies. Code card for you. Move it to the front. Let's go grass. Ooh, darkness, darkness. Okay. No. Well, I got the Dolive and the Smolive, I guess. I've got to get the final been doing from Scarlet and Violet. Let's try Paldea Evolved. Espeon, do you have something for me? Did you bring me a goodie? You know, your pal Vaporeon really knocked it out of the park. How about you? You've got anything for me? Let's check. Fire? Ooh, water. Let's see. Pikachu and Glimora. This is looking to be a dud. You know, if we could call the uh, Vaporeon tin a god tin, this one would be the exact opposite because it is nothing but misses. Swings and misses everywhere. Espeon, make me eat my words right here. Give me an amazing card. Something I can cheer for. 
I mean, the Espeon card itself is gorgeous, but I forgot to guess. Maybe that'll help. Tinker Tough. No, God! No, hey, guys, God, please, Jump no, Puff again. No, no. Jump Puff and Paldea Evolved is starting to feel <laughs> like when I hit those clay dolls in uh, Obsidian Flame. Espeon, very disappointed in you. Very, very disappointed in you. Alright, Jolteon. Slide you out of here. And there's your photo card. There's our Jolteon tin and our four packs. Scarlet and Violet Paldea Evolve. Here we go. Can we continue to try to make some of that money back? We'll find out. Boom. Over to the front, we're gonna go fire! No. Oh. Cyclozar Reverse, and an Arboleva. And you're almost as bad as Jumpluff. I was under the impression that Scarlet and Violet had a pretty decent hit rate. I'm starting to get all the same cards. Still can't complain, still got the Miriam. But it's something besides Arboleva over and over. Well, there's a grass. Ralts and Revavroom. Well, swing and a miss. No hit happening there. This, though, this is the opportunity for Paldea Evolve to come out and show me what you got. Jolteon, did you bring me something great from Paldea Evolved? Looking for an illustrator card. Looking for any sort of hit at this point with Darkness. Limit reverse. And a four Retrous EX. Alright, this is actually a really, really playable card. That that ability to uh, take five basic grass energies and attach them to any Pokemon you want and then knock this thing out, you can set up so much. You basically just get five free energies you attach right away. All you gotta do is give up two of your prize cards. Nice to get a hit. Thank you, Jolteon. Let's get one more here. Can we get a rarer card than that. That was only 50 cents. So, can I get a little bit more? No, I'm getting greedy. Let's go with water. Ooh, I Cat bulb and spirit too. I think the biggest bummer that I'm having right now when I'm pulling some of these is that I'm getting the same cards that I've even pulled just today. It's not just like I'm getting cards I already have. I'm getting cards that I've already pulled today. Sylveon, probably my least favorite evolution. I never really got into the fairy typing in general, um, but I have a Sylveon. Let's see what we get out of the Sylveon V Hero V Heroes tin. This is our last tin. There it goes. <laughs> there's the Sylveon V. And there's the code card. I gotta remind myself, each one of these packs is worth about 250 so, uh, you know, trying to get some of my money back here. As long as I can get some cards that are hits, I'm getting very close. Two fifty a pack is a great deal. I might have said two dollars earlier. Well, I spoiled the uh, energy for myself. I finally did get the fighting energy. Toss that aside. Deck there and huh? Jump Pluff versus Arboleva. Which one is the card? that I'm going to end up getting every flippin' time. I just, I'm unbelievable, you guys. It's unbelievable. I'm starting to wonder if they only pack certain cards in these tins. Now, I was able to get the Miriam. I don't want to discount that at all. But, I get a Jump Pluff out of one of these Paldea Evolved. I just might lose it. Electric. No. Technia and a Gyarados EX. There we go. Hey, a hit card. Can't complain when I get hits. Now, this is just a fantastic Gyarados uh, attack card. 180 plus if the Pokemon's already got damage on it. It does 180 more. That's just that's just awesome. So, water with a water Terra type. That's just really cool. <laughs> um, worth about $1.20. So, I'll take that. Making some of the money back here. 
So I got two packs left, and unless I get something really good out of either one of these, it's gonna be close on whether I've made my money back or not. I'll have to do the math and find out. And each one of these packs is worth about 250, or I spent about 250 per pack. So if I can get that money back, grass. Ooh, fighting. Able to poke her fi eye. Sable eye. Ay ay ay. Our very last pack of the day. It's Paldea Evolved. There's a chance I can get an Ayano, a Magic Carp, or something else amazing. But we're gonna see if I can at least get some of my money back here. There's a chance, and it just ends up being Jump Bluff again. Goat Guard. Moving the energy to the front. We're gonna go Water for Hope of Magic Carp. It's Grass. Sprigatito. <laughs> And a tink and tink. So nothing doing there. And well, here's all the cards that I ended up pulling today. Nothing too standout-ish, fantastic, amazing, except for, of course, my special cards here, Mabostiff, Starly, and Miriam, the uh, the nice, nice Miriam card here. I'm going to be happy about pulling this one for a while. Um, put these all together with the promos, the bulk, things like that. I end up just a little bit short of my $60 goal, but that's okay. I've gotten the Miriam, and uh, that in and of itself really still makes my day. And well, that's going to do it for me today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like on this video. Drop a comment down below. Which of the Evolutions is your favorite, and did I draw a good card from their tin or not? Um, if you wouldn't mind also considering subscribing to the channel if you're not already. We've just surpassed a thousand subscribers and are working towards continuing to grow this channel. And if you wouldn't mind also sharing this video with a friend, that could really help with the channel's growth as well. I hope you have a wonderful and fabulous rest of your day. That's going to do it for me. Rhino, out.